the house that Jack, excuse me. This is the house that Jack built, listen. How quietly doors are closed, one finger on the catch for fear of slams, nothing to disturb his well-deserved downtime. After all, as Jack says, he needs a bit of peace and quiet. This is the house that Jack built, look, lights only on rooms where he is sat with you. After all, as Jack says, why would he want to be alone when he has spent all day at work missing you? This is the house that Jack built. Notice how pristine and clean. There's a schedule for you to follow. Daily, weekly, monthly tasks. After all, as Jack says, what else would you do all day? This is the house that Jack built. Count the cars on the drive. Only one now, a stay-at-home wife means sacrifice. And as Jack says, you never were very, very good at driving. This is a Jack, this is the house that Jack built and this is his money. Statements needed, questions asked, things to be balanced. After all, as Jack says, what could you need that he doesn't provide? This is the house that Jack built and this is the phone he bought for you. The latest model in a shell pink case, but somehow all your contacts, photos lost. After all, as Jack says, you're his life now. This is the house that Jack built and this is the gym he chose for you. Women only, lots of treadmills, no need to run outside now. Sorry, page turning issue. When you get old, your hands get really arthritic and nothing works. After all, as Jack says, you owe it to yourself and him to lose that post baby fat. And this is the house that Jack built and this is the clothes you wear. Long sleeve cardigans and calf lead skirts. After all, as Jack says, you really don't have the legs for jeans. And this is the house that Jack built, planning for a new baby. Pills spirited away, tub of folic acid on the table. And after all, as Jack says, you're not getting any younger. And this is the world that Jack built. And this is the leaflet you found in the library, now hidden in the lining of your purse. Plan carefully. After all, as Jack says, what else could you be without him? Thank you.